off to find new friends We're on the road again Come with me On a road that never ends Out in the big, big world Oh, check it out! I'm at the beach! At the ocean! Isn't it beautiful? <laughs> did, did you know most of the planet Earth is covered in ocean? Not only is the ocean a great place to play and swim and boat and have fun, but all life on the big, big world depends on the ocean. Even you. <laughs> it's important to save the oceans and keep them clean because without the ocean, there's no life. Sometimes people in this area have built nesting platforms for the osprey. Oh, osprey are a type of bird that used to be endangered. But thanks to people building nesting platforms and not using pesticides on their gardens, the osprey have come back. <laughs> Whoa, look, there's one now. Paper bags? Yeah, it's a great way to make a scrapbook out of reused and recycled paper bags. <laughs> Pretty leaves? That's right. We'll just glue the leaves in here. Oh, hey! We're making a paper bag scrapbook of some cool leaves we collected yesterday. <laughs> leaves! These are some of the most awesome leaves we've found yet. Leona want all the leaves. Oh, all the leaves? Leona want. Okay, well, think about this, Riona. If you had all the leaves, what would be on the trees? Yeah, I think, and tell me if I'm wrong here, but you want enough leaves for your scrapbook. Enough? Yeah, enough is a lot. <laughs> it's exactly what you need and not more. We don't need to build a house in every tree. We don't need all the honey from every bee. All we need is just enough for you and me. Then we're doing fine. We don't need to build a road to every lake. We don't need to have a third piece of cake. Save it for somebody else for goodness sake. If you've got yours, and I've got mine, then enough is enough. We don't need so much stuff. That's just right, it's just right, and it isn't too tough. Too little's too little, too much is too much. So say when, when enough is enough. Yeah, enough is enough. We don't need so much stuff. Cause just right is just right, and it isn't too tough. Too little's too little, too much is too much. We got plenty, enough is enough. You got it, Riona. <laughs> oh, hello. Hello, you two. Oh, hey, Birdette. You look especially lovely today. Well, thank you. I am, actually. My feathers seem especially flat today. Flat feathers are beautiful feathers. <laughs> oh, Birdette, beautiful. Yes, thank you. You're not so bad yourself, you cute little slothette. <laughs> <laughs> so tell me, Birdette, um... Uh, what are you... Looking for? My things. The things I had gathered. Where are they? Uh, I, I don't know. <laughs> Maybe if you can tell us more about them, we can help you find them. Well, they're clearly not here, so no need. I'll just keep looking. I wonder what she was looking for. Hmm. Incoming! Oh, hey, Winslow. You gotta help me. I just can't take it anymore, please. I'm desperate. Huh? She's gone whoa, too uh, far. Uh, Winslow, uh, whoa. Uh, what do you think? <laughs> well, you've gotten our interest. What's going on with you? And is it Smooch? <laughs> it's Smooch. She's crowding me out of house and home. Too much stuff. She's collecting everything in sight. Um, too much stuff. In monkey hat? Hmm, interesting.
interesting. Maybe I should come take a look. <laughs> um, Fiona, stay. Take care of leaves. Oh, pretty cool leaves. <laughs> okay, you can stay. I'll go with Winslow. Let's see what's going on with Smooch. Whew. Another coconut shell. I know I had 53 of them, and I only count 52. Mm. Whoa! Hey, what did I tell you? Oh, hey, Snook. Uh, you don't see a coconut shell lying around outside the coconut shell pile, do you? Oh, well, that's the one I was missing. Thanks, Winslow. But, Smooch, why do you need so much stuff? Oh. I love collecting, and you just can't have too much. And I just found this great big pile of stuff that someone left behind. Oh. Well, um, I don't know. Look, now let's see. I'll put the books in a pile over there, and these lovely snail shells. Uh, oh, hey, Winslow, do you mind if we move your bed, um, somewhere? <gasps> My bed? <laughs> All right, Smooch. It's getting pretty crowded in here. Mm, you're right about that. Maybe, Winslow, you should find another monkey hut. All right, I've had it. I am not moving my bed. I think we've got some talking to do here about how enough is enough. Hey, guys, guys. Oh, where are my things? Oh. Oh, I had such a lovely collection of things, and now it's gone. What took me so long to collect all those things? How very strange. Things don't just get up and walk out of my nest. Do they? Hmm. Well, I'm just wondering, if you don't mind me asking, did you see anyone take my things? Well, my things must be here somewhere. Perhaps they fell out of my nest when I wasn't looking. Well, then they would be down there. Oh, oh my, what is that? Well, that's one of my hats. Aha, uh -huh. there's another one of my hats. Well, that makes two, but I had so many more than that. Oh, another one! But how did it get there? Well, this is quite a mystery. Well, there's only one way to find out. I'll follow this trail of hats and see where it leads. I still don't see why if nobody wants this perfectly good coconut shell, why I can't collect all of them. Well, it's because you're squeezing me out of house and home and monkey hut. <laughs> I'm sure we can work this out. Uh. Oh, hey, Burdette. Aha! Uh -huh. So you monkeys stole my stuff. What? Don't look at me. What do you mean, Burdette? These hats and umbrellas are things I've been collecting. Oh, sorry, Burdette. I didn't know. I just came across this pile of stuff when I was swinging by. Oh, maybe it was by your nest. Sorry. Well, thank you. It took me a long time to collect these things. See? Burdette is collecting a ton of stuff, too. Why does she need all those hats? Uh, yeah. You don't even wear a hat. Me? <laughs> of course not. I'd never. I don't need this stuff. What are you talking about? Whoa, I, I think we should hear Burdette out. What are you doing with all this stuff you've collected if it's not for you? Well, every year around this time, I like to gather whatever I don't use and whatever anyone else will donate, and I give it to other creatures that might need them. Oh, what a great thing to do. When you have too much stuff, give it to others. Wow, Burdette, that's pretty, well, Nice of you. <laughs> well, as a Ketzel bird, we believe that giving to others is very important, especially if you have what you need. And, as you know, I'm quite comfortable, you know, with my feathers and my beautiful, perfect nest and... <laughs> hey, Burdette, do you think I could do that too? I mean, 
give stuff to other creatures that need it? Well, I don't see why not. That would be lovely. You've got a lot of stuff, and some of it's quite nice. Oh, the hippos are gonna love these hats. <laughs> this is gonna be fun. Hey, can I help you guys? I, I know somebody who'll love this. Oh, that's good. That's good. <laughs> well, I think my work here is done. Hey, come over here. Now you put your things away. You sure have learned a lot. It was so much fun to play. Now tell me about the best parts of your day. Time for best parts! Whoa! <laughs> <laughs> you got it, Riona. It's time to talk about the best parts of your day. Best part? Easy. Oh, best part's easy, huh? <laughs> well, what is it? Mm -mm. Beautiful leaves. These are some of the most awesome leaves we've found yet. Oh, beautiful leaves, right. And now you've got a whole scrapbook filled with beautiful leaves. But, 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 we only take just enough leaves for a scrapbook. Right, you took just enough leaves for your scrapbook. Because enough is enough. Yep. That's what Smooch learned too. When I went to the monkey hut, <laughs> it was pretty wild. Smooch had collected too much stuff. Oh, what did I tell you? I had too much stuff. <laughs> but Burdett and Smooch and Winslow decided to give away all the things they didn't need to other creatures who could use them. What a great thing to do when you have too much stuff, give it to others. Stuck, look, beautiful. Wow, that is beautiful, Riona. <laughs> and it's got just enough leaves, I think. Don't you? The world goes spinning round and round, it's true. We've had our time and now we're through. But you and I forever will be friends We'll try to touch the sky where clouds never end And we'll search for wonder all around And you'll find me hanging upside down And you and I together in a big, big world Try to touch the sky in a big, big world You have to go, I know it's time So give me five This whole world is yours and mine La 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 It's me, Snook. Come play and learn at pbskids.org. <laughs> See you there. We're off to find new friends. We're on the road again. Come with me on a road that never ends out in the big, big world. Hey, I'm here with Rob DiGiovanni. He's the senior marine biologist here at the Riverhead Foundation for Marine Research and Preservation. Oh, wow. So, Rob, is, is that a baby sea turtle? Yes, it's a baby green sea turtle. It's, oh. it's one that we rescued from Orient Point. Whoa, wait, wait, you, re you rescued that little turtle? W yes. What did you rescue it from? Was it like stuck on a tall building and you had to go <laughs> fly up and rescue it? No, we don't put on a cape, but in this case here, it was on the beach. So. Um, so a family was walking along the beach and they found nutmeg washed up and um, nutmeg was cold stunned, which is like hypothermia or freezing. She, she was too cold, so, so you guys warmed her up? Yes, we uh, brought her back to our facility here and, and uh, what we did is warmed her back up and we got her to be, be able to swim around in this tank. Is, is, now, 
Is she gonna live in this tank her whole life? Is this her new home forever? No, actually, um, what we want to do is put her back out into the wild as soon as possible. Oh, so you rescued her. You're, you're making her better so she's okay. And then they're gonna let Nutmeg go back in the wild and grow up just like a real wild sea turtle. You hear that, Nutmeg? We're gonna get you out of there soon. And now it's time to go. But we will meet again. I'll be here or just around the bend out in the big, big world. Funding for It's a Big, Big World provided by contributions to your PBS station, the New York State Governor's Office for Motion Picture and Television Development, and viewers like you. Thank you. PBS Kids.